Backroads is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund with money by the vote of the people November 4th, 2008. It's always easy to see things coming Than it is to see them say goodbye I could feel my wheel still turning To the wind that's blowing outside For the first time I feel this moment For the first time I feel alive The moment we stop pretending Is the moment that I realize minute I leave I'll know will be the minute that I turn around it'll be the first time and the last time that I ever want to be more like you it's always easy to hear your words it's always easy to see you smile Reflection from the earth comes a beautiful country mile. I walk down every day, reflect my mistakes I made to be the first time and the last time that I ever want to be more like you. It comes around when my lost and found bin is full helps explain why I feel this way. It's always easy to see things coming than it is to see them say goodbye. I could feel my wheel still turning to the wind that's blowing outside. And the minute I leave, I'll know will be the minute that I turn around to be the first time and the last time that I ever want to be more like you. How did you get into music in the first place? It started when I was just a little kid. Music was always around our house and my dad worked at Paul Bunyan Broadcasting as the sports director for many years but he also did DJ shifts. So I would always go there after school and just be like in a studio setting and listening to music. And my parents were both into music. It was always around. When I was seven I was asked to perform the national anthem at the Metrodome for a Twins game. And I'll never forget being down on the Metrodome floor and looking up at thousands of people and lit my fire. You know, I was like, wow, this is really cool. And just started to pursue music more after that and started taking like piano lessons. And that kind of launched me into guitar and everything else that I've pursued since then. Time is creeping in faster than it sounds. I'll make believe something to turn the night around. And the miles an easy climb. I stumble and I fall, living in a rerun after all. But I'll skip just like a stone. I'll shoot just like a star. I rearrange my plans to be where you are. And give me a little more. That'll make me feel warm 
something to hold on to, something that I want to, and drop no excuse why you see me this way, and that'll have to do today. float just like a snowflake beauty from all sides haven't really met you maybe we collide and turn this cold weather into something all right maybe turn these lovers into love tonight and give us a little moment that'll make us feel warm something to hold on to something that we want to and drop no lies just say what we'll say, and that'll have to do today. Am I wasting time? Is time well spent? When I'm holding on to something that hasn't happened yet In the dreams that I'm dreaming Ain't nothing but a pipe dream But I'm holding on to them To see where they take me And maybe give us a little moment That'll make us feel warm Something to hold on to Something that we want to And drop no lie Why I feel this way And that I'll have to do and that'll have to do, and that'll have to do today. Hey. Thank you, friends and neighbors. How did that go from playing piano to being in bands to now going solo? Above my piano music, you'd see the tablatures for guitar. And I will never forget the day I went to my parents' closet and took out that nylon six string and <laughs> blew the dust off the thing. And I tuned it up to the piano and I started to learn the guitar chords. And that's, that's my guitar lesson. That's it. That's all I've ever had. I've never had formal lessons. It was just kind of using the piano as the roots. Of, of the tree, if you will, and I could just sit there and learn how to play these chords. All through middle school, high school, I was in these really like kind of punk rock bands and just had the time of my life doing it. And it wasn't until I was about 16 I went up to Winnipeg Folk Festival and my life changed when I saw what people were doing with like an acoustic instrument. It blew my mind. I was like, I want to do that. And that's where I deviated from playing in bands and just kind of went my own way and uh, started writing songs. This tune is kind of about one of those maybe relationships that you had that took off and it was sore and it hit 40,000 feet and it was good. And, you know, you, you didn't quite make your destination because you had to kind of make a detour landing and a uh, good song came out of it. It's called Firefly. It goes like this. I walk in through the exit and the ceiling is on the floor The leaves have no trees and the dimes are in the nickel jar I got you heavy on my mind so tonight it's T42 With your cup steaming full awaiting you The sun, stars and moon fall down but they have no clue the birds, bees, and butterfly fly away too. The flame has no candle to attach itself to. Reminding me another day of missing you. Word in is the first thing I want to say. 
We could start with the ending and get it out of the way. Or turn back the clock, turn it inside out. Yeah. Or maybe I'll just draw a blank and frame it on the wall. The lake streams and oceans cry and sing the blues. All the ships and boats drop anchor and wade it through. A minute feels like an hour, seconds do too. Reminding me another day of missing you. Well, somebody, somebody to love. I take me higher so I know how to fall. Or put an action to this moment uh, tonight. Or maybe just shine away like a firefly. Maybe my tracks don't fit your train. Or maybe the beginning is the ending anyway. I dream somewhere in between. You think of me too. But this is me. But this is me. I'm missing you. Thank you so much. Firefly, that's probably the song I'm most proud of lyrically. It was the most difficult song I've ever written. It took me two and a half days and I wasn't gonna quit until it was done in two days. It had to be done, that was the goal. I had the little groove over coffee at 6 a.m. but I didn't have any lyrics, but I liked the direction of the song. And so instead of trying to spend too much time thinking about it, I get out of the way, go do something else. I just went to town and to do, do errands, went grocery shopping, went to the bank, and at the grocery store I had to walk into the exit of the building because they were doing repair work. And the whole ceiling was on the floor. All the drop ceiling was on the floor stacked up, and I walked in through the exit and the ceiling was on the floor. And that's how that song starts. So I'm like, okay, okay, you know, here we go. So I started to write the song when I was in town you know, going to the bank and they went to give me some change and they broke open some dimes and they all spilled into the nickel tray. And I remember the, the gentleman going, oh, I got dimes in my nickel tray. And I'm like, don't we all sometimes? You know, it was kind of like, but that line made it in. And so over the course of two days, I just opened my ears to what people were doing. And within two days, I had a completed song. I just made myself more available and just kind of let it in. Everyone I know has got a story In between the beginnings and What we choose becomes moments it Makes a stamp of where we've been and With the wind becomes emotion Changing with the breeze Sometimes I don't know how to do this And then I fall like rain I know you know, I wear my heart on my sleeve. I know, you know, it's just the way that I'm made, but I feel at home. Whatever makes you fly, whatever feels all right, whatever keeps you smiling, into the morning light where you feel alive and find that place that feels at home. In your home It feels brand new when something's changing All the while remember when Life is just a game we're playing 
It's not all about the winds. I know, you know, I wear my heart on my sleeve. I know, you know, it's just the way that I'm made. But I feel right at home. Whatever makes you fly, whatever feels all right, whatever keeps you smiling, yeah. Into the moonlit sky where I feel alive and find that place that feels at home. At home. Please let these moments treat you well. Yeah. Please let these moments treat you well. Whatever makes you fly. Whatever dance you try, whatever keeps you honest, yeah. Into a brand new day, let's take this all the way and find that place that feels at home. At home, yeah. Thank you so much, friends. I really appreciate you being here. Taking back a topic of conversation Taking back a moment in time What we hear is better than what we're saying If we open up our mind Something is better than nothing Something's a song that we sing Something is all I've ever wanted I'm learning That something can be everything Looking at you, looking at me. These are the stories of our lives. To hear that little bird sing yeah, takes me back in time. Something is what we're waiting for. Something always comes in time. Something always holds a question when searching. For the answer, there's something you might find. No more hold on you. Something always shines on through. And anything will never hold on to what you dream. Because anything could never be something. To find out what you're searching Searching always comes in stride To find out what you're feeling What it feels to be alive Something always is beautiful Something sometimes makes me cry Something's playing on the radio And something will always be our life, our life. Thank you so, so much, you guys. What's the experience of performing live like for you? Having a crowd there, kind of giving immediate reaction to your music, like what's that experience like? Kind of like floating. It's one of my most favorite things to do. Um, I love snowboarding. That's my winter activity. And to me, they're really close. There's balance and there's harmony within it. 
and I just feel like everything kind of disappears. And when you have an audience, that just becomes beautiful to see reactions. I've been in the audience, you know, I go to concerts all the time. So it's fun when you have somebody connecting with you, maybe with a lyric line or maybe a guitar sound or something. It's just that energy, you know, that it gets exchanged. It's just a beautiful thing. I think that music is so powerful. It is my favorite thing in the whole world. And I just feel that it's the one thing as people we really all have in common. I mean, we can, I've traveled to other countries and I can't speak to people, but we can listen to music and we're happy. You know what I mean? We, we can dance, we communicate. Um, so I feel like there's such strong communication through music and it just brings everybody together. Late tonight, I'm thinking about you. Got lots of time, and I'm not sure why I'm thinking about you. When we learn to grow up, have a moment that we hold on to. I'll take this moment, spend it thinking about, thinking about you. I drove for miles, and I hear the road under my treads, the tread that takes me to places I, I've never been. You shared those miles when you rode along up in my head. That stretch caught me. I was thinking about, thinking about you. You know you got a special way. Yeah, you're so extraordinary, I know. You make time stand still when I'm thinking about you. I could ask the question, but I know what the answer will be. So I will make it up, pretend and have to make believe. Next time I see you, I'll act like a casual fool. And then later, that's right, I'll be thinking about you. Maybe my balance is off. No, I think it's right on, but I'm sure that clock has not moved. When I'm thinking about you, yeah, yeah. It's late tonight, I'm thinking about you. The sun goes down and stars comes out, it's all I do. And I'm a thinking and a hoping and I have to believe that all this thinking about you could get you thinking about me. Thinking about you. We are here at Supple Studios in Bemidji, Minnesota, and we are so lucky to have this wonderful space uh, Troy Foss, owner and engineer, um, is just a superb person to work with, very talented, very educated in recording and audio, and it always sounds fantastic. So we're so lucky to have such a wonderful space in northern Minnesota. So what's it like to be a musician in northern Minnesota? Lucky, I feel. There's an audience. People are very supportive. People want to learn to grow within it. So when you collaborate, I find that it's a labor of love that people are in it just for that simplicity. And the talent that's up here is just overwhelming. I'm just blown away by how somebody can come into the studio or a live gig that maybe you've never really met and they can put whatever instrument on they're gonna play and they play three chords and you're just like, what, you know, this is awesome. Where, who are you, where'd you come from? And, and usually they're like, oh, I do this once in a while, you know? <laughs> and, Being a painter involved with the arts, I'd paint inside all winter, outside the other months. Maybe I could be as good as Van Gogh, I could show my work at local art shows, have no worries, and never be rushed, just be so happy. 
Across the states, have all my meals at a roadside cafe. Maybe buy me a dog who would ride shotgun. I'll name him Cisco. I'd maybe call him son. Have no worries and never be bored. Just me and Cisco in the open road. the country and share them with everyone maybe have a song on the radio and once in a while a sold out show have my road crew no matter where we are I'll be living me and my guitar Thank you all so very much for hanging out tonight. I really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Have a wonderful night. I think that each song I performed for Backroads was a representation of me as an artist today. And I think that I'm so lucky to have had the opportunity to travel and to work with so many artists and allowing me to write these songs. Backroads is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund with money by the vote of the people November 4th, 2008.